In this short video, I'm going to mention the HVAC systems and how should we think about them as architects. HVAC stands for heating, ventilation and air conditioning systems. And these systems are an essential part of our buildings today. These systems are defined as the technology of the indoor environmental comfort. There are several types of HVAC systems that are used around the world. In warmer climates, air conditioning systems are often used to cool buildings. And in cooler climates, heating systems will be used to provide warmth during the colder months. These systems are basically chosen and defined according to the energy need of the building and uh, the one who does that work is the mechanical engineers that work along with the architect on the project and define what system and what capacity to use according to their calculations. That's why I'm not going into much details in the engineering work but as architects what should we generally know about uh, these systems that we should take into consideration well designed. First of all, the properly sized and designed HVA systems because an HVA system that is too large or too small um, for a building can lead to uh, much energy waste or poor indoor air quality. So proper sizing in the design is the efficient way to go. Another thing is to consider high efficient HVAC components. So choosing HVAC components with uh, high ratings such as uh, EER or COP, which are again the measures that tell how this device uses energy and how does it uh, optimize the input energy to give the uh, output requirement. Of course, there is also a proper installation and maintenance. This ensures that the system uh, operates at peak efficiency and reduce energy waste. Last thing I want to mention is to use uh, energy management and control systems can help optimize the performance of the HVAC systems and reduce the waste energy.